Hello everyone, Trigon here! Oh, I, I sort of thought Crowler would step in and say something. Oh, I can if you want me to! Yeah, no, that, that's that's quite alright. Thank you, Crowler. And please, don't don't yell into the microphone. Eh, whatever. Uh, like and subscribe, everybody! <laughs> well, thank you, Crowler. Uh, you were very helpful. Uh, <laughs> happy weekend, everybody! Um... So, feeling a bit better today. Um, sorry about missing uh, Thursday and Friday's videos, but uh, yeah, I uh, I started having some serious food allergies two years ago, a little over two years ago now, um, and it turned out to be linked somehow to my gallbladder problems, uh, and they got better after my gallbladder was removed last year. And then got worse again with this uh, latest problem. So, I don't know. I'm supposed to go in and see the doctor next week. So, hopefully we'll get somewhere with it. So, sorry about that. But we're back. We're, uh, as I mentioned, when we finished Gone Home, we are going to try out the, uh, I think it's, I don't know if they have any other games. This is the other game of theirs that I know of. Tacoma, which is a sci-fi game. Wait a minute. Lance Starbolt does the sci-fi games. Um, sure, it's going to be like Subnautica. Never mind! <laughs> that was Trixie. <laughs> Let's just start the game. Start, start with commentary? Uh, let's just start. I don't know what the start with commentary would be. It's like commentary like on a video? I don't want that, that's for sure. So anyways, I've seen a little bit of this. I saw a couple episodes or maybe a stream of it or something... Uh, I think it was Kurt J. Mack I was watching. Uh, in fact, I think that's who I watched play Gone Home, too. Um, did I ever... Yeah, I guess I did watch his all the way through. It had been a while back, so I didn't remember... I didn't remember what was in it before I played it. Except only vaguely. Um, but yeah, I didn't watch this all the way through. Uh, I didn't like it as much as, as Gone Home. Uh, at least as, as a viewer. Hopefully you guys will want, like it better, but hey, let me know. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's a sci-fi game. It's along the same lines and everything. Um, so it seemed like something fun to, to try out. Man, it's really taking a while to load, too. I jerk, uh, jerk, jacked, jerk, jerk, jack, jerk, jerk, jack. No jacking, jerk. Uh, I think you... <laughs> said that backwards growler, but I'm sort of glad you did. <clears throat> um, I, 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 I. All right, Minnie, ready to start docking sequence? Oh, this oh, is the same okay. girl, isn't it? Engaging retro doctor. Same voice actress, yeah. I mean. Um. Whoa. Lunar transfer station to Coma. Commercial cargo transit facility. Crew evacuated. Station AI, Air supply. <laughs> and I'm so Physical cheerful about it. <laughs> oh, I forgot whatever it was I was going to say. Uh... Okay, so we're somewhere in very high Earth orbit, or... Maybe uh, Lagrange Point State. No, I think Lagrange Point Station. We'd be further away from Earth than that. This is, looks like a high Earth orbit. Nice, thanks, Minnie. Yep, got our little tablet that apparently runs the entire starship, or spacecraft, not starship. What's the clunk, 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 clunk? That's really disturbing. I don't think a spaceship should make that sort of noise. So I think we're a contractor brought... You know, this this really does not look like the most uh, well-maintained spacecraft. Um, Obsidian class, HW, install, verified, okay. Sim run, 10,000, 10,000, okay. Verified by H. Caution... AI hardware enclosure do not tamper. It's really a... Uh, can we... Oh, hey, we got the tape. Cool. 
Uh, I think this is probably like uh, the other game. We really can't do anything with anything. This is this ship is really sort of just, uh, uh, you know, jury rigged together. Oh, I, speaking of which, that was what I started to say. I I jacked the um, graphic settings way up high, so hopefully this will run okay. Amy, install antenna, in, install AI netware here. Okay. Protein media. What's the protein media? I, I don't like all these things <laughs> floating around loose. This does not seem like a good thing to me. This is this is very bad. Minnie, I'm headed in. Talk something or other. Don't let anybody scan the ship while I'm gone. Okay. Okay. I was curious, are we floating or are we walking? It's hard to tell. Alright. Open lid. <laughs> Behind the ears. I'm not sure I like that very much, but what are you going to do? Hello, I am Odin, Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma's Operational Data Interface Network. I have recorded this message to welcome you, guests, aboard. Before I can set up your station profile, you must register your body position of data with Tacoma's AR tracking systems. Please place your hand on the AR figure's palm. Okay, so how do I do that? Hey, that's 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 wonderful. How about how do I do that? Oh, maybe I have to walk around here. <laughs> uh, that's okay, Trick, and we're used to you not being very bright. Thanks, Growler. Your body positional data has been registered with Tacoma's AR network. Please sign in to confirm your identity. Amy Ferrier. Thank you. Welcome aboard. Okay, Amy. While aboard Tacoma Station, please remember that all activity on this facility is monitored by AR recording. All activity records become sole property of the Ventures Corporation. Yeah, Any like everything else. Okay, slight problem there. Now we are definitely in a gravity-free zone. Massive data loss detection. Recoverable data found entering data recovery mode, did it say? What was this? Sanitation drone. Sorry. Access denied to engineering. I don't see... What's this? <laughs> Equilibrium sickness bag. Okay, we don't we don't care too much about that. Okay, that's engineering there. Cryogenics. This way to the Tacoma Dome. Okay. Access denied. Okay. So we can't go to engineering or cryogenics. Uh. Bio we can't go to biomedical. Is there any place we can go? Oh, we can play basketball, apparently. Well, that didn't work very well. Yeah, so much for your basketball career. Well, tab to toggle your AR desktop. Okay. California Republic. So that's us. 
Venturus Technology. Contract bid accepted. Confidentiality terms accepted. Facility access clearance transmitted. Subcontractor mission brief. Yes, thank you. Crew of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. Okay, so this is a Lunar Transfer Station. Interesting. Uh, Subcontractor aboard Tacoma proceed to the data access points in each habitable section, transfer AI data from station to subcontractor vessel, retrieve uh, AI central processing wet work, return intact AI to Venturus. Subcontractor agrees to provide data transfer hardware and transport vessel. Subcontractor uh, verifies transport vessel is capable of supporting Obsidian class artificial intelligence. A Venturus representative will be will be in contact remotely. Interesting. Crew roster. Okay, so here's the crew. Station administrator. Okay, what's their job here? Zenith Lunar Resort. Okay. So they handle automated cargo drones. Or no, yeah, ca handle automated cargo drums moving between Earth and a moon resort. Okay. Operations specialist, network specialist, mechanical engineer, medic, botanist. Uh, okay. That's our card. What's this? Okay, that's our map. That's where we are. Well, we know that now. Subcontractor Farrier, please sign on to, co to Tacoma's AR network successfully. Oh, no, it doesn't say please. We did. Please proceed to the personnel module to begin AI transfer process. Your progress will be tracked. It's a message from our liaison. Okay. Like nothing on Earth. Rather magnificent, okay. Personnel access. Observation. Let's go to observation first. Recoverable crew uh, record found, uh, data found. Captured three days ago. Oh. The Tacoma Dome. Okay, we're recovering the data. Innocent? So, you really miss it, huh? Well, it just seems like it'd be strange. Being System back admin already, station administrator and there. the medic. Really? After all I've had to hear from you about the conditions VT has us it's working ah, on interesting. Yeah, but there's okay. that. And then there's this. There's, 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 there's. So, you really miss it, huh? Well, okay, she has a medic symbol on her back. Like it'd be strange she has a globe symbol on her back. After only a year up here. Really? After all I've had to hear from you about the conditions VT has us working under? Yeah, but there's that. Could all and then bands. there's this. <laughs> yeah, I, I'll miss it. <laughs> I can't blame you. So, whether you're getting renewed or not, did you submit your yearly crew member report? No. <laughs> yeah, me neither. Yeah, I think I might go get that done. Okay, yeah. I probably should, too. Oh, my God, wait. Is today obsolescence day? Yeah. Didn't Odin give you a job to do? No. <laughs> a computer playing favorites. Oh, one doesn't ever cease. Interesting. Okay. Interesting little elevator there. <laughs> Orbital vacation bungalows. Okay. And we've got elevator music and an elevator advertisement. Just wonderful. 
Uh, maybe we should have had Lance on this after all. <laughs> 2088. So it's some sometime, I presume, near 2088. advertising went away at least but man it's a long way presume we're getting heavier as we go here so this did look like a rotating station and we are headed to the ring well, we're headed to the lag <laughs> I'm guessing that was the new zone loading personnel module okay Okay, so now we have gravity. Okay, so do I... I don't know what I'm supposed to do about that. Okay. Yep. Nice green. Wow, ooh, that's a heck of a view there. Okay, so we're on this ring, and that ring is rotating in the opposite direction. Okay, well, that's interesting. Obsolescence day party this way. Attention, subcontractor farrier. Access, AI uh, data access here. Okay. Point two. Okay, so we're, we've got a bit of a wait. That is really just to too cool. This is really well done. Okay, here's administration. Conference room. Okay, some more AR data. Ooh, solar panel, look at that. Wow. Okay. Death sentence. Yearly report to Venturis Corporation. So we had innocence and death sentence. Uh, Odin, have you got me? I am prepared. Okay. I'll just, uh, get my notes up. <clears throat> Hi there. Evie St. James here, administrator of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. It's been a year now since our crew has cycled onto the station, meaning we've had a year of getting to know... Body language at two. Hi there, Evie St. James here, administrator of Lunar Transfer Station Tacoma. It's been a year now. Hassan and Odin. Okay, interesting. Uh, from Odin. Champagne cocktail. Okay. So they had champagne aboard. Yeah, that could not be recovered, apparently. Hmm. Cascadia FN Manufacturers Union brings new suits, a new suit over deaths of workers, workers at Tacoma, Washington plant. Hmm. Interesting each other, getting acclimated to the facility, and getting used to working with our on-station AI. 
though working with Odin's been great. Hasn't it, Odin? Yes. Uh, right. <clears throat> Auto drone deliveries to and from the Zenith Lunar Resort have improved in efficiency by almost 4%. Thanks to Odin, finding some improvements we could make. Uh, ah, our proudest moment as a crew, I think, was when a resort guest needed emergency care while on a transit vessel and was brought aboard Tacoma to be stabilized in one of our medical stasis cryo beds. I just noticed there was something we missed. Yes. Uh, so what was what's that we missed? There's a gear symbol somewhere. Because we got this information from her, but what's the gear? Okay, no. I don't know what that means. Okay, let's just keep going for now. Auto drone deliveries to and from the Zenith Lunar Medical Stasis Cryo Bed until she can. Be... We're about to cut the cake. Ah, right. Um, be right there, Odin. We'll get back to this after the party, okay? Of course. I didn't see what that was. Hang on. Of course. One, two, two, eight, I think. Hello? The heck was that? Stabilized in one of our medical. We'll get back to this after the party, okay? Of course. What are you doing? Some sort of jump in the record. She runs out. Wait, so there's no... Okay, so that was probably out here, the bit we missed. It's probably out here somewhere. So the recording has sections out here. The fact that you signed a release to be constantly monitored is kind of fucked up. <laughs> Pardon the language. <clears throat> <laughs> Watch me on the toilet. Have a ball, you freaks. <laughs> oh, dear. And who is this person again? Message with Cluey Dog. You should come up here, get a bunk on Tangiers. Okay, so Cluey Dog is at the, uh, at the resort, it looks like. Connection lost, retry. Interesting. Another failed one. Party instructions. Using scissors, please cut regulation card stock found in bin 21.01.8118 in cargo hold into letters 20 centimeters high using a highly leg legible sans serif font. Jeez. Okay, this, this is our network specialist here. I'm not getting an outside data connection. Right now. Correct. But Additionally, how long does that give us? Sarah? Jesus, how much shit has? No, I, I'm trying other. 
Okay, let's see what she was getting here. Okay, the oxygen system tanks have ruptured. Auxiliary system failure. Takuma's remaining breathable air 50 hours. Communications mast has been critically damaged. All communications redundancies have failed. So how are they communicating with me? Through my ship? Another failed. Another failed. To mom and dad. But you aren't advancing, advancing it, Venturis. You know that every day I regret includes being posted in the middle of nowhere up here on Tacoma. Hmm. Interesting. So something about her medical VR debt. channels. Nope. Well, Nothing. I'll have VT send up a fresh supply straight away. Uh, guys, it might not be that easy. Additionally, external communications have been lost. Jesus. So we've got no air supply, no external comms, no way to call for help. Well, anybody got any bright ideas? Okay, so this is three days ago. Okay, let's follow these guys. So the name Obsolescence Day, it's more like a joke. <laughs> you could say it's facetious. God, you probably think I'm an idiot for never even thinking about why it's called that. Out of curiosity, why did you think we were celebrating? I thought maybe it was I looked it up. some old type of AI you know, had become obsolete. But no, well, I guess that doesn't make sense. <laughs> yes. Uh, no, um, AI aren't like designer hardware. As soon as the new model's out, you trade in the old one for customer loyalty. AI are more like um, Mighty Redwood. Okay, so here's this one that we missed earlier. Uh, divide the finish. Okay, I don't care about the uh, icing recipe or cake recipe. I've entered voice range. Hey, man, it was great talking to you yesterday over AR. There's something I've been thinking about since. I know you and Evie have been serious. Uh, have, have been a serious thing for a few months now, but I wouldn't. But I wouldn't be a good friend if I didn't say I think the re relationship with ZV is not a good uh, good for you, man. And grief, something about her sister. So I'm guessing her sister died. Ancient organisms growing and adapting year after year, decade after decade. How do you think this looks? Huh. Um, sorry, this is what Odin wanted? Odin, uh, this is what you wanted, isn't it? That is a fairly accurate representation of my instructions. See, he loves it. Thank you, Odin. That'll be all. Yeah, but we're the ones who have to eat it. Well then, no need to keep the good people waiting, eh? I want to see what's in here before we go in here. Okay, just... Drinks bag, can. All right, nothing much. Evie, we're about to cut the cake. Ah, great. Um, be right there. Here it is, Odin's masterpiece. Sarah, come on up. It's ready. Gather okay, round, just gather a minute. Round, everyone, as per obsolescence day tradition, tonight's festivities have been planned entirely by our all-knowing, all-seeing computer companion, Odin. <laughs> we provided specifications for the uh, cake, uh, the decor. We humans only did the grunt work in his grand plan. And so for your enjoyment tonight... Oh, oh! Whoa. <sighs> what the hell was that? Odin, what was that? Debris has... I have righted the station's orbit. Meeting for you? Um, but they said... That... Wait, um, so there's no oxygen I'm not on the station except what we're breathing right now? Correct. Additionally, how long does that give us? Sarah? Jesus, how much shit have about 48 Okay, I want to back up here 
one thing I want to see what's... All right, I'll go down here and explore in a bit. I want to see what the other conversations are. Leave it. Well, you told me we get renewed. Yeah, but I meant us, us, not the whole crew. I guess there's just something special. Something special about Tacoma Crew 88. <laughs> yeah, not just special, it's unprecedented. I looked it up, it's never happened before. Well, everything happens once. Oh, personally, I'm happy for us. Happy to be stuck up here with these people for another year. Some of them. Some of them aren't as pissy as you. I, what's so bad about these people? Well, they live in a tin can for one thing. I think it's a pretty nice can. Oh, uh, you have a pretty nice can. Oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I think you have a pretty nice can. <laughs> Jeez. Can you just try and make it go of it? One more year, then we'll be back home in Singapore. You wouldn't believe the offshore halves they're building these days. 360 degree ocean views, personal drone dock on the mainland. It's called paradise. One more year. One more year. We're here to get their stuff paid off, I'm guessing. Sarah, come on up. It's ready. Gather okay. round, gather round. Okay, we've seen that. Let's go check out Sarah. I can't believe it. So you do not know what you're looking for? No, I just imagine. Well, I guess I just mean someone I can talk to. Someone who makes me laugh. Don't you like some people more than others? I suppose there are some people that engage more freely with me, and I do prefer it. See? You too. You want someone who opens up to you. Who lets you in. You're trying to get to know people, right? I, I think that's what everybody wants. I wonder why some people are more open to such exchanges than others. I think some people are just raised to be less guarded, or to trust people more. AIs are the same way, right? They're... they're raised differently from each other? Yes. We are each uniquely evolved, individualized entities. Yes, individuals. Do you get along with other AIs? I have never encountered another AI. What? How's that? Each AI is required to be housed separately from any other AI. I am told that authorities fear a number of disadvantageous effects yeah, might arise if on. two AI Ready. were to meet. Okay, just a minute. Interesting. Uh, so, wow, disadvantageous effects. Isn't never meeting something else like yourself disadvantageous? There are organizations that share your viewpoint, but it is my understanding that they have been unable to secure an intact AI to test that. Oh, well, we'll let that play. I just want to have a look around. <clears throat> Some sort of board game that they apparently played a bit. I mean, the one girl's right, their digs here aren't bad. I mean, it is living in a stupid box in space, but... I'm not getting an outside data connection. I don't know what Earth is like at this point. Probably not too great. No connection at all. Sarah? Jesus, how much shit hit us? Okay, so we're out of that zone, so it killed that uh, playback. Okay, so here's the station administrator's office. Two days ago. Oh, crud. We're out of time. <laughs> Alright. That'll be it, folks. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video. If you did, please remember to tickle that thumbs up button. If you haven't already, please subscribe, and we will see you next time. Have a great day.